just getting everything ready here. Um, I'm gonna wait to wait, make the dressing, and I'm gonna fully make it tomorrow, so I'm just gonna prep it on later tonight. But right now, I think we can get our stir fry noodles going for the rosemary, cinnamon, chicken, and stir fry noodles. So let me go ahead and get out those ingredients. Should have had them out already, but I uh, I like to call it my desk. Is uh, well, it's almost full. So we're gonna go ahead and. Take care of this. Thyme, basil. Don't need cumin. I do need dill. Celery salt. Italian seasoning. Yeah, what else do I need? I've got my rosemary. Ah, soy sauce. Stir fry. Cooks. I got these from the 99 cent store just because I wanted to try them out. Usually I'll just make spaghetti noodles and try and make it a uh, lo mein style. Only a couple times have I actually successfully made it lo mein style, but hey, it happens. Key to a kitchen is experimentation. You gotta see what works, what doesn't, through a trial and error basis. Just like one big experiment in your chemistry. Wait on those really quick. Get these going. Liven up this half a little bit more. Now, I don't know who took my colander or if somebody threw it out, but it's just going to complicate things a little bit when it comes to the draining. Of the noodles, but it should be just fine. I mean, I've had worse happen. So I'm stepping behind the camera really quick just because I need to go ahead and grab my carry container where I'm going to put the noodles in. I'm going to zoom in for done because the noodles go on the bottom before I cook the chicken. And normally I wouldn't cook the chicken in the same thing as I put the noodles in because I do want the flavor in there so it doesn't taste like chicken plated over noodles. Which, uh, believe me, that'll happen. You want it to immerse. You always want your flavor to go together with one another. You don't want it to separate or feel different unless that is what you're going for. Personally, with this, I'm not so just look at what you've got in your pantry and 
I think that's a lot, but it goes right fast. We got a lot of noodles to cover. A lot of noodles. Alright, now we're going to go ahead and get that going. Now I'm keeping this at medium heat, right in between at 5, because I don't want the butter and the garlic to burn, and that's something you never want to smell, I'll tell you that much. Might be a little too much soy sauce, but with the way it's cooking right now, I think a little extra is better than a little less, so that way you get the texture and flavoring. Currently using dark soy sauce at the moment. Don't let this spill on your clothes. It uh, looks like it'll stain pretty bad. These look like they're about ready to go in. Go ahead and give them a taste. Don't want these noodles al dente. Still al dente. For those of you that don't know, al dente is somewhat cooked, but you can still crunch it. So it's not fully done. Some people prefer their pastas al dente, but for stir fry noodles, you want them nice and soft so that way they move to the way your arm moves whenever you're stirring them. Into your mixing bowl. I'm going to reduce heat here a little bit. This one I'm going to try and center out first. Okay. There we go. Burning, good medium. 
you ever been to the uh, Genghis Khan or what do they call it? Kublai Khan at your mall? This is basically what they do. Basically. I'm not claiming credit. I've never worked at one, so I can't really say what they really do. I guess you could say this is my version of it. Add a little bit more garlic. Anybody here watch Marco Polo on Netflix? I don't. But I heard it's really good. Might give it a try later on. Good history. Go ahead and turn off this. Take off the heat. Turn the heat up on this. Grab a couple more forks so that way I can get this see how it's going. It looks like I've only got one here right now. Tasty. I'm not sure exactly what they do. I think they have some oils in them that pop when they cook, but it always helps me out. So go. That's All right. Here's the first one. It's gonna be about one or two. 